Hello everyone. In this session, we will discuss a problem regarding the previous theory topics. The first problem is the unit step response of a system is given by. This is the unit step response of the system. In this, find out time constant B. TD means delay time. TR means rise time. D. TP means peak time. MP means peak overshoot. This is percentage of peak, peak overshoot, magnitude of peak. Right. So if you look at the waveform, observe here this waveform is it starts from zero and for up for 10 seconds it will not reach the 100 percent it will have a difference tolerance of plus or minus 2 percent so that means he mentioned in the diagram the tolerance is 2 percent plus or minus 2 percent clear yes but this is mentioned the unit step response unit step response means the finally it will it will reach the magnitude is 1 yes so to understand this first what is the system we are using for that purpose look at here we are giving unit step input to the we don't know order of the system we will get the output this cft this output value is this output waveform is like this here we don't know the order of the system but if you clearly observe here the if it is a second order system second order system is having the oscillations like this and otherwise uh, otherwise some some like this or uh, some of the like this these are the outputs of the second order system generally so that's why if you observe here this is directly first order system it is a first order system by observing the output waveform so here already we have given the tolerance what is the meaning of tolerance tolerance is nothing but the percentage required to reach the 100 percent of the output he is given plus or minus two percent yes so settling time we know that settling time for settling time for plus or minus two percent is you know that four time constant when we are discussing in theory directly so in that we will directly find out the settling time that is so settling time equal 4 tau yeah here to reach this plus or minus 2 percent tolerance it required a 10 seconds this 10 seconds is the settling time so i can write 10 equal to 4 into tau from this we can write the time constant equal 10 by 4 that is 2.5 second so therefore the time constant tau will be the 2.5 second this is the first thing first point next what is delay time here for second order system you know the delay time that is 1 plus 0.7 zeta by omega n but here it is a first order system we have a formula delay time equal 1 plus 0.7 zeta by omega n e is for for only second order so that's why it is not applicable here but here we should apply what is delay time delay time means time for time for reach 50 percent of the final value 50 percent of output final output yes so here but what is the output by observing the diagram the output i can write 
whenever a step input is given to the system the output value c of t equal to some magnitude k into 1 e power minus t by tau is the output but this is the unit step that's why c of t equal to 1 into 1 minus e power t by tau this is the output waveform this is the output waveform magnitude this is the magnitude directly you know that here delay time is 50% of the output so I can write like this for C of T for C of T the formula is 1 minus e power t by tau but to to 50 percent 50 percent mean the final output is actually 1 for 50 percent means 0.5 into 1 then the time period will become delay time by tau here to reach 100 percent to reach 100 percent this output is 1 to reach 50 percent the magnitude will become 0.5 that's why I am writing here so here we can write e power minus delay time by tau here the time required equal to delay time yes so 1 minus 0.5 so this value is the 0.5 here I can write delay time by tau equal to log 0.5 what is this value 0.693 from this 0.693 but not 0.693 it is minus 0.693 yes so we can remove so minus delay time equal to tau into minus 0.693 both minus will be cancelled <coughs> from this delay time equal to tau value you know that time constant is 2.5 second into 0.693 so by multiplying this we will get delay time equal to 1.73 seconds so to reach 50% of the final value it takes 1.73 1.73 seconds okay next next thing is we need to find out the rise time okay we need to find out the rise time so here uh, in the second order system so it is generally a first order system so to understand this rise time we know that here to get this rise time for first order system rise time can be defined like this rise time is defined like this the rise time is the time to reach time to reach 10% of final output to 10% of CT to 90% of CT 10% of final value I can write infinite or final value I will write the infinite that means the rise time we can write time to reach 90% or time to reach the 10% first we need to find out how much of time required to get the 90 percent so for that purpose I can write first I will find out the time to reach the 90 percent of the final output so I will write like this this is same formula the formula is to reach the 90 percent 0.9 into 1 we have to find out the 90 percent of the by tau is 2.5 okay so we will we will solve this and e power minus t by 90 into 2.5 will be equal to the 
this is 0 0.1 okay by solving this by doing the simplification finally we will get to reach 90 percent of the final output time required is the 5.70 seconds and next time required to reach the 10 percent of the final output this is the same thing this is the 0 0.1 final output 1 minus e power 10 by 2.5 e power minus t 10 by 2.5 equal to 0.9 so by doing the simplification we will get to reach the 10 percent of the final value the output equal 0 0.263 seconds 0 0.263 seconds so from this we can write the rise time equal time required to reach 90 percent minus time required to reach the 10 percent time required to reach 90 percent is 5.70 minus 0 0.263 seconds so so 5.70 5.70 minus 0 0.263 seconds we will find out the rise time value is 5.437 seconds 437 seconds and this is about the rise time the last point is the last point is peak time okay in this if you observe the in the given output waveform there is no peaks just straightly it will reach the output some particular but it doesn't have any oscillations like this so that's why it doesn't have any peak peak time peak time doesn't exist so I can write like this for first order system first order system doesn't have doesn't have any peak time so it doesn't have any overshoot also doesn't have any overshoot maximum peaks also doesn't have so that's why TP and MP doesn't exist these two things are doesn't exist these are not possible for the first order system uh, we will have some you know, so this is the solution for the given problem but we need to observe some points here those are make it as a note it will be useful for us so in that note the given output is the given output is like this so the given output it will reach like that the given output value is like this here so we can take this is the output waveform for this output waveform is look like this generally right yeah this is the time period for zero if you observe here you can compare with the second order system actually it is the first order system given system but you will compare the second order system how so compare with how many types of second order system first is under damped system under damped is not look like this not valid because under damped system waveform is like this like this waveform it is not possible next over damper system observe the over damper system if you observe over damp system the over damper system also reach the point and it will decrease but up to this particular area up to this particular area both will be look like same both will be look like same so over damped system characteristics as 
ओवर डैम्पड सिस्टम कैरेक्टरिस्टिक एज वेल एज फर्स्ट आर्डर सिस्टम फर्स्ट आर्डर सिस्टम कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स बोथ आर सेम ओवर डैम्पड फॉर सेकेंड आर्डर एंड फर्स्ट आर्डर सिस्टम कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स बोथ आर सेम ओके सो दीज आर द वेरी गुड ऑब्जर्वेशन वेरी गुड ऑब्जर्वेशन इज यूजफुल फॉर एनालाइजिंग द सिस्टम्स यूजफुल फॉर एनालाइजिंग द सिस्टम्स ओके सो बाई ऑब्जर्विंग दीज टू वे फॉर्म्स सो दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग बट यू नीड टू यू नीड टू थिंक यू नीड टू रिमेंबर डिले टाइम फॉर फर्स्ट आर्डर सिस्टम ओके राइज टाइम एंड यू नीड टू ऑब्जर्व दिस इज ऑल्सो ए नोट पॉइंट एंड फॉर डिले टाइम ऑल्सो इट इज ऑल्सो ए नोट पॉइंट ओके सो दिस इज अबाउट द प्रॉब्लम रिगार्डिंग द टॉपिक आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू एंजॉय द सेशन थैंक यू